It's Friday, March 31st, 2017, 1235 p.m. Pacific Daylight Time. I'm in the old Highway 97 where it crosses the Crooked River. I'm standing in the road, but don't worry, there's no cars coming. This is a bike trail now. I'm actually at some sort of state park. I think it's called Crooked River State Park or something like that. I'm gonna just do a quick walk around while I'm here since this is a sunny day. Hopefully I'll even see a freight train go by or something. Let's see, here are a couple signs about where in the world we are. I'm not gonna sit here and read them all. But, so this, uh, yeah, here's one, blah, blah, blah. Uh, excuse me, <laughs> just had lunch. So this is um, that bridge over there, the concrete one. That's the new Highway 97 bridge. That one replaced this old one, which is here, steel truss. I kind of like steel, but whatever. <laughs> this bridge is still in very good condition. In fact, it probably still hold cars, but obviously they don't need two bridges right now. Here's information about the new bridge being built. Ooh, ah, fancy. Yeah, so th this one's obsolete. It just wasn't wide enough and so on. I'm gonna stop here a second. So looking to the left, there's another steel bridge. That one is um, the U Burlington Northern Santa Fe Railroad. And then there's the three sisters behind it. I'll look at the mountains later on. So now I'm walking over the Crooked River Gorge. Notice how on the bridge here, there's the old concrete uh, original walkway, but then they got this new steel handrail, whatever you want to call it, help keep people from falling to their deaths. It's 300 feet down. So as you can see, it's a bit dangerous. In fact, I'm not even 100% sure, but I'm thinking that white stuff over there, nah, it could actually have some frost mixed in. It's a, it's not that warm out here. It's probably 50 degrees, but it gets down below freezing at night. So in the shade, the frost can last a little while. See the Crooked River, got a lot of water flowing. Sure be enough to go inner tubing or something like that. <laughs> Looks a little dirty and gross, but it's not necessarily the bad kind of dirt, you know. It's not drinking water, it's a river. I forgot if the speed limit on the road is over there is 55 or 65, but as you can see, vehicles go by pretty quickly. Through Central Oregon 97 is like the main road. It's not a lot of detours unless you want to go back country and explore all these weird back roads, which should not be a time saver. So, a lot of little birds flying around. I don't know how well they'll show up on my GoPro. This thing doesn't have a zoom lens. Notice there's a fence there to keep people from getting too close, falling to their deaths. So here I'm at the other end of the bridge. The, there's actually a bike trail this way, but for the most part, it's just alongside the new Highway 97. Obviously, the old Highway 97 has been covered up now. Let They let it grow back up. If you don't maintain a road, it actually gets covered with plants pretty quickly. It doesn't take that long. Like they say in Jurassic Park, nature always finds a way. I'm gonna go over here real quickly. Just wanna see that sign, oh, a POW MIA sign. You are not forgotten. Notice there's a wooden fence here to keep people back, but then another metal fence over there. I'm gonna go over here to this edge, take a look. So here we are, Crooked River Canyon, bridge constructed, 1926. Notice there are actually stairs down here. I'm not sure if there's any point in me going down here, but I guess because I can, I will real quick, very carefully. There's no handrails on these stairs, they're pretty steep. If there was snow or ice, I sure as heck wouldn't be down here. Oh, wow. This is actually kind of cool because look, now that I'm down here and behind this metal fence, well, one, I can look at the railroad bridge. Boy, I'm hoping a train comes. And then over here, I can look at this new bridge, but notice I can go underneath it too. I think I might just do that.
Boy, it's a nice bridge though. So especially like the concrete. The concrete holds it rigid, you know, like a rock. Okay, well, I'm not gonna bother to go much farther. But yeah, here's the view underneath the bridge. Lots of steel painted up a bit to keep it from rusting too badly. Interesting how the cross girders or whatever you call it, they don't line up nice and perfect. I think that's just because of the arch shape of the lower level, however you call that, as opposed to, you know, being evenly spaced out. Huh. There's the new bridge. Looks like they got some ventilation sh windows up there. Wonder, yeah, there's no way you're gonna catch me in there. Anyway, all right, I'm gonna go back up. I'm gonna cross the bridge again, see what else I can find. There's a trail along the other side, a paved trail along the other side of the Crooked River that goes all the way underneath that railroad bridge. I definitely wanna go over there. Check that out because over there I'll be able to see the mountains, the Cascade Mountains. <laughs> Crooked River, milepost 112.64, Highway 4, Route 97. Okay, what's the difference between a highway and a route? Weird. Peeping over the railroad tracks, that's the three sisters, I think. Notice how over there it looks like the wall's about ready to peel away. But that is solid rock, so I bet it's been like that for a long time. Either way. If you stay behind the fence, you're not going to be near there. Over there, you can see there's a concrete fence along the whole thing. Just a few feet high, enough you can easily see over. It's actually a sign saying to don't bring dogs over here. Because dogs will try to jump up on that fence. They'll have so much momentum, they'll keep on going. Get a Puppy Darwin Award. Well, this would be a nice place to watch a train go by with this railroad it only has like a few trains a day i have no idea when they come by i'm not even sure if we're allowed to be here at night i don't think i've yeah it'd be kind of cool to be here at sunset or sunrise okay here we go Crooked River, down at the bottom. 